just not like him. He wasn't that kind of person. I couldn't believe when I saw on TV him getting out of that car with that AK-47 or whatever. I said, that can't be him, but it was. And I never had seen him dressed up in them kind of clothes he had. He, when he was here, he had jeans and t-shirts and flip-flops and I couldn't believe that was him. When he came, he did his prayers like they do twice a day or whenever, and uh, he wasn't trying to push no Muslim religion off on anybody. He never said much about it. And I respected his beliefs, and when he said he couldn't eat this and he couldn't eat that, well, I would try to, you know, work around it and cook something that he could eat. So he loved pumpkin pie and pumpkin bread. <laughs> well, what a good person he was. So kind and loving. Just very good with his little son. He's doing anything in the world for him. He always wanted to help somebody like his younger brother never could hold a job long enough and so he, the younger one was living in Utah and he was divorced from his wife and then he came down to Phoenix and Nader put him to work in that carpet cleaning business so he would have some kind of income to support his family and he'd just do anything for anybody. I guess just like letting that man move in with him. I mean, something needs to be done about that organization. They just go all over the world ruining people's lives. <laughs>